Hey kids, guess what? It's almost Easter. We have 12 days until Easter. So Sunday, April the 12th is when we would normally celebrate Easter. Well, we may not be celebrating together at the church this year, but we're gonna still celebrate Jesus and the reason for Easter. And so we're gonna talk about a bunch of different parts of Easter over the next 12 days. Every day I will post a video and it will give us a clue in an egg about what the subject of the lesson is for that day. And then all of the pieces add up to Jesus' resurrection. So pay close attention. Today I'm gonna to be reading from Matthew chapter 21. I'm gonna start at the end of verse one. I'm gonna read through verse three, and then I'm gonna pick back up again at verse six and read through the end of verse 11, okay? And then we will open now. Wait a minute, you can't have Easter without Easter eggs. So Miss Tanya has a dozen Easter eggs, one for every day. So the first one is blue. And I'm gonna read the scripture and then we'll see what we think the object in this egg will be. Do you hear it? Okay, here we go. Jesus sent two disciples saying to them, go to the village ahead of you and at once you will find a donkey tied there with her colt by her. Untie them and bring them to me. If anyone says anything to you, say that the Lord needs them and he will send them right away. The disciples went and did as Jesus had instructed them. They brought the donkey and the colt, and they placed cloaks on them for Jesus to sit on. A very large crowd spread their cloaks on the road, while others cut branches from the trees and spread them on the road. And cloaks is kind of like our robes or our jackets or our coats that we're wearing or a piece of clothing that we had is what they put on the donkeys and what they put on the roads. It says, The crowds that went ahead of him and those that followed shouted, Hosanna to the son of David. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest heaven. And when Jesus entered Jerusalem, the whole city was stirred and asked, Who is this? And the crowds answered, This is Jesus, the prophet from Nazareth in Galilee. This is Jesus. What do you think is in this egg? Let's see. It's a cute little donkey. Jesus rode into town on a donkey. Now, usually when someone as wonderful as Jesus, like a king, Jesus is our king, but when a king would ride through town, they would ride on a fancy horse. But Jesus chose a donkey because a donkey is usually what the average person would have. You and I wouldn't have a huge chariot to ride down to the store with. We would probably have our old car. Well, then most people would just have donkeys. And so Jesus wanted to be like us. Jesus came from this wonderful place in heaven down to live on earth with us. And so the donkey represents that Jesus is for all people, not just the rich, not just the poor. He represents all people. And he chose to ride into town that day on a donkey. So that is day one, our donkey. Stay tuned tomorrow and we will find out what is in the pink egg. Do you want me to give you a clue? Ooh, I'll see you tomorrow and we will see what that holds. Bye.